Okay, it's time to talk about the interwebs. I haven't done this kind of video in a long time, so let's do this thing when I was your age. BAM! When I was your age, well, the internet didn't really exist like it does now. When I was your age, before the internet was a popular kind of thing, it wasn't just for people who had offices and did work. I played games like CD-ROM games and like pinball and Minesweeper, things like that on my computer. And that was the only thing I used for my computer. I didn't even know what the internet was. When I was your age, probably around the time I was in elementary school, I decided to get an email because my dad had an email, my mom had an email, so why don't I make my own email too? And my dad said I could. When I was your age, there was this thing called AOL, which is American Online. So it was basically the first real like internet browser kind of thing. There was Internet Explorer, things like that, but my family and I used AOL. And basically it was just about email, connected with each other, sometimes searching the web. But that's basically what I used it for. It was just mostly email. So going back with the email thing, that's what it was, AOL. When I was your age, probably around the time when I was in middle school, between sixth grade to eighth grade, there was this thing called AIM. And this was the way to connect to people that were your friends. This is when the big thing started where everybody started getting screen names. Basically, it was a chat box, but you it's not a chat room like online, like on a website. It was just something that you had on your sidebar and you connect with people. And this was a huge thing back in the day. They didn't have Facebook, so this was the only way that you could keep in contact, especially because we didn't have cell phones at the time. When I was your age, I used to talk to my friends all the time on AIM. It was just one of those things. Like, people talk to each other on Facebook now, but Facebook isn't just about talking with people, it's about updating your status, posting photos, videos, liking pages, playing with bit strips. I just started getting into that. It's quite entertaining to watch myself look like myself, a little avatar. But back in the day, AIM was all where you connected things. And a lot of people had embarrassing screen names. My friends and I were looking at our old screen names a while ago, and uh, well, I'll just admit to you that my first screen name slash email was spongegirl1994 because I liked Spongebob at the time. Okay, my dad said I was allowed to do that, okay? He actually made it for me. He was like, you like Spongebob? We're gonna make you Sponge Girl. And that was my first screen name. When I was your age, this was the sound that your America Online made for you. That means it's working. When I was your age, I didn't, it wasn't like a Facebook back then when you were younger. They had children websites like DisneyChannel.com, which I still have, CartoonNetwork.com, which I still have, Nick.com, which I still have. They have games on there, people. You could actually go on there and play games. And that's what I did back in the days. I would get up on a Saturday morning at seven o'clock when everybody else was asleep because I was a child that liked to wake up early. And instead of watching Saturday morning cartoons, I, which I did, but I went on the computer and I played like Raven, that's a Raven games and Lizzie McGuire games. And I played like SpongeBob games and Trigger Treat Beat on Cartoon Network. That's my favorite Cartoon Network games. Things like that, that was so much fun. When I was your age, they didn't have a Facebook. It was called MySpace. I never had a MySpace. I didn't get into that because I was young and I was like, I'm not gonna sign up for that. That's for people who are old and teenagers. People like that go on it. But I knew a lot of people that were like middle schoolers who went on it, which you weren't allowed to do. And I thought that was morally wrong to do, so I didn't. But it's kind of funny when you look back on MySpace and everybody's posting things about bands that they like and funny pictures and you're like a 12 year old posting pics. Good for you. You had a life back then while well, I just stayed and played. That's a Raven Games on DisneyChannel.com. <laughs> when I was your age, there was no big YouTube. YouTube was not really there. There wasn't a big Google. There wasn't Facebook. Like I said before, these websites were barely there. They were just starting. Like YouTube began in 2003. It isn't as fancy as it is now. I mean, Google Plus wasn't around in 2003, people, so let's go back. Let's go back to the old YouTube. We don't want all this. Okay, maybe not that far because we like the video quality and all the choices that you give us. But Google Plus, 
go away. This is YouTube. We want to connect with our viewers and we want to comment with them, but not like this. Not like this, okay? Not like this. So back in the day, we didn't have this. A week ago, we didn't have this. And that was the internet for me when I was your age. Hey guys, it's Alyssa, and I hope you enjoyed this video. I haven't made it when I was your age in a really long time, especially because the last one I made was probably like a year ago at home, and now I'm in college, and with a totally different camera and new editing software and stuff like that, so it has changed a lot since then. If you want to go check out the other old episodes of When I Was Your Age, please click on this playlist so you can go back to the first episode and you can see how much I've changed since then. You're awesome, I'm awesome, and you should press the subscribe button because I'm gonna try to make a lot more videos on this channel. Whenever I have an idea, I will put it on YouTube for you. Please like this video if you had an embarrassing screen name and comment below the embarrassing screen name that you had. Let's share each other's screen names and we can all have an aim party together. Just kidding, no one uses aim anymore. God dang it, people. No one does that. All my links are in the down bar below of everything that you should follow me on. And I will see you guys around, okay? Please subscribe. All right? Ready? Hope this internet doesn't crash, because it's 2013, people. It's not too th it's not 1999 anymore. Alright, bye. Bye! So, like this video if you remember any of these sounds from AIM. A well, it's the messenger, because I certainly do. Welcome to my childhood where weird sounds happened a lot.